everybody and welcome back to Yakuza 4 Remastered. Oh my god, last time just oof. お前らよ。なんでお前あの日スカイファイナンスの前の現場にいたんだ。男の顔にお前の指紋がべったりくっついていた。死体に素手で触れるデカがいるが普通。おいてね。俺の話聞いてんのか。He's got his thing in there. I can't tell if he has brown or black hair. もういいですか時間ないんで時間だおい谷村なんすか一つだけ忠告しておいてやる一人で何を嗅ぎ回ってるのか知らないが妙なことに首突っ込んでると親父さんの二の前になるぞ Nice shoes you got there. Those are the shoes of the man who killed my father. どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ。どうぞ
Titan Mortar as well, with the, is this the closest I can get? How close can we get to them? This is the closest we'll get to them. So in the original version, Tanimura does not look like this. He has shorter hair and his face is a bit different. Uh, the reason he is different is because the original Tanimura was... Uh, basically, he was like labeled as... Basically... He had, there was false information about him having drugs and being in possession of like cocaine and stuff like that. And again, I, I say it's false information because he didn't have anything like that. The man was queen, but he was kind of backstabbed by some people. And, uh, um, yeah, he was backstabbed by some people and basically the shame that he felt, he just, he couldn't go back into the community, and in Japan, shame is like a big thing. It's kind of like what happened with the Judgment, uh, one of the guys in Judgment, a Yakuza spin-off game. Except I think that guy was actually doing stuff while the actor for Tenomura in, in the original Yakuza 4 didn't do anything wrong. It's kind of like the Vic situation here in the US, but not so much. But, yeah, that's basically the thing here. And there is one thing I know I can do right quick. One thing that I want to make sure I get done. Here to buy. I think I need to buy two of these. Yeah, so two of those. Now you may be wondering why I bought two of those. Well, I'll show that to you later. I kind of want to see if there's anyone around here who will just pick a quick fight with me. Uh, let's just do the objective maybe, I don't know. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I want to fight somebody right now as Tanamoda. Because I want to try and remember how his stuff went. Like, how was his fighting? But maybe I'm not going to get in a fight with anybody because we have cops on every single damn road. I don't think we can fight anybody because again there's cops everywhere actually wait a minute what he was walking around like he was gonna do something god damn all right it doesn't look like we're gonna be getting any fights until i progress the story some more this is the reason i bought those plates you'll see here Excuse me. Oh, Tanemura-san, are you to play Mahjong again today? No, uh, not today. Can you tell me which members were here in the shop when I was playing yet here yesterday? Hmm, well, there was one person I wasn't familiar with. There were probably someone who came here for the first time yesterday. The other members were those two regulars who were playing there. Oh, that's right. I remember now. Thanks. You're very welcome. Did something happen? It's nothing. Don't worry about it. Well, alright. Hey, you got a minute? Oh, it's on more son. Back to do some more damage? Nah, I'm here to find a snitch. And it better not be you. Snitch? What are you talking about? Save it. The chief said someone filed a complaint about me yesterday. Come on, Tanamura son. That wasn't the first time I lost a major chunk of change to ya. If I was gonna snitch, I would have done it a long time ago. Plus, I don't even want to know what you'd do to me if I did. Right? Uh, for sure. Uh, I can always earn back the cash you rolled me for, and uh, the damage you would do would probably be a lot more permanent. You got that right. Oh, but what about the other guy at the table? I wouldn't be surprised if he did it. Yeah, he seemed like he was hurting for money. 
Bet he was hurting even more after you dropped in and steamrolled us. Huh. So where is he now? Oh, he's, uh... Wait a second. What? Donna Moore's son. Tell me if I'm wrong, but... This isn't official police business, is it? So why should we give away this information for free? Hey, you're right. This is the perfect chance to recoup some of our losses from yesterday. Ah, come on, guys. Well, what's it gonna be? Ah, all right, fine. Name your price. I won't ask much. Like I said, I don't have a death wish. How about two silver plates? They give those out as prizes here, so that should be simple enough. You really want to stick it to me that badly, huh? Fine, silver plates it is. <laughs> Thanks, officer. We just want to win something for once, so I don't care how you get them. Easiest ways to win are buy enough mahjong sticks in exchange with a prize counter. Probably. I think I did this, um, originally, but I didn't do it as quickly. Nope, nope, nope. I think, I do think I did this on the PS3 version, but I did not do it as easy. Like, as quick, again, is what I mean. Yeah, I got them right here. Hey, wait a second. These are total knockoffs. True, but all for the intents and purposes. There's still several plates. You never said anything about quality. Really? You're gonna do me dirty like that. And you call yourself a cop. Hey, I get you your plates. You tell me what you know. That was our agreement. You come up you came up with it yourself. Man, you suck. Well whatever. Should have known better than to try and pull one over on you. Okay, so the other guy was at the table yesterday. His name's, uh, Luida? Yep, that's your guy. Can't say we know him that well, but we do see him around every so often. He mentioned he didn't have a traditional job, per se, but he works at Shikifuku parking lot. Oh, the one over on Shikifuku and Senro? Yep, that's the one. Now, I don't know what he does over there, but he did say that's where he makes his mahjong money. So I guess he must be doing something right. Okay, that's all I need to know. Oh, but be warned, he was super pissed after you left yesterday. He said you weren't going to get away with what you did and all that crazy stuff. Yeah, he was kind of freaking out, well, honestly. Yeah, he's a pretty big dude, too. Wouldn't want to be in his way when he's mad. Anyway, that's pretty much all we got on him. That's more than enough. Guess I'll swing by the Shikifuku parking lot and pay our friend Edel, or Uida, a little visit. See if he's the guy who narked me. Yikes, sucks to be a him. Anyway, come back again and give us another shot at you, yeah? It's only fair. <laughs> sure. Happy to take your money anytime. I'm out of here. Fuck Mahjong. So the guy who ratted us out is all the way up there. There's still so many damn cops. I can't get into no fights with all these damn cops around here, man. Memos. Uh, I don't care. It, it, I thought this was a Mr. Try and Hit Me stuff again. Hey, you! What's this? A challenger. Finally, someone around here who actually has some balls. I go by Mr. Try and Hit Me. The jobs in the name hit me under a minute and you get 50,000 yen. Only costs three grand to play. Wanna give it a shot? <laughs> Hell no. Do I look like a familiar to you? Or do I not look familiar to you? I mean... Oh shit! You're that Mahjong monster! Bingo. Now look, I have some questions for you. Got a few moments? Nope, don't know nothing. And I definitely didn't rat you out to your superior officer either, so why don't you scurry on back to Donut Patrol? You're not very bright, are you? But thanks for saving me both of us the time. Or, er, saving. 
That was the part where I teach you a lesson for being such a sore loser. <laughs> Go ahead and hit try. Can't touch this baby. You gotta be kidding me. It ain't no joke, jackass. They used to call me the Artful Dodger back in the day. Because my footwork alone is a masterpiece. So get ready, because for the very first time in Kamurocho history, Mr. Try and Hit Me is going to try and hit you. This is going to be some groundbreaking shit right here. Yeah, good luck with that. I'll be handing you your ass in under a minute. You think you're hot shit, huh? Alright then, game on. Whoa, hey, you can't grab me. I wasn't a part of the deal. Yeah, asshole. I don't like how small his health bar is. God damn it. Maybe I shouldn't spam it. Yeah, it kind of has a bit of a cooldown on that for a reason, you know. What the, how did I get him all the way over there? What is this? Go! Whoa! Ow! God damn it! Here, have this. Fucking ow! Oh, he dead. Max health and max heat increased. Man, what is this shit? He got hit. Shit. How about it? Wanna try again? Sorry for ratting you out. I won't do it again. Damn right you won't. What'd you do it in the first place? Well, it's like this. I've been living as Mr. Try and hit me for years here in Camarocho. Well, there's this one scary looking guy in a gray suit who challenges me to a fight every year. And every year I end up losing. Each time I train harder before fighting him again, but I can't seem to beat him. So I started playing Mahjong to take my mind off it, but I ended up getting hooked. Turns out I'm pretty damn good. But just when I started thinking about Mahjong might be a good way to make a living, you had to come along and spoil the fun. I lost a shitload of money to you. So I was pretty pissed with Mr. Try and Hit Me thing and the Mahjong thing going all to hell. So I picked up the phone and, yeah. Anyway, I'm ready to suffer the consequences. Do your worst, I don't care. Uh, I'm over it. What? I'm saying you're free to go. After all, it's not like you're still gonna you're still get you're still out to get me. And besides, I got a few good punches in. What's this called even? Oh, uh okay. Thanks, pal. Just watch it. Wrap me out again, and you won't get off so easy. Yes, sir. I wouldn't dream of it. Right, well, at least I gotta work out some aggression. Huh. And he leveled up. So what I think I'm gonna do is, um, huh. I should go for the. No, I'm gonna save. Well, yeah. Incoming message from HQ. Report of fighting on Theater Square. Officers in the vicinity, head to the crime scene. I swear, petty instances like this never end. I guess it's close by. I'll look. Uh, sorry! Shut up, bitch. You're the one that started this, and now you just want to back out? You owe me money. Alright, that's enough. I'll let this one slide if you disappear. And quick. Huh? You got a problem? Maybe I'll just take your ass and like what I deserve from you instead. Oh yeah, there's something I do now. Come on over here. Fucking asshole. Come here. What? 
Come on. Hit me. Do it. Hit me. Come on. Aha. That's the thing with Tanamura. You can make them hit the wall. Oh my god. Ooh, yeah. Oh, oh, you're no joke. Who the hell are you anyways? I'm Tanamura, a detective here in Camarocho. Shit, fucking cops. Watch your mouth and get the hell out of here. Arresting punks like you is a waste of my time. Right, consider me gone. Thank you, you saved my life. No worries. I was just passing by. Don't think too much of it. But you should watch your step from here on out. Y yes, sir. I apologize for the trouble. I'll be more careful in the future. Whew. That takes care of that. Uh... I think I know who this is. Looks like you cleaned that up quite nicely. No, that's a guy. I thought this was supposed to be a woman. No, we see her later. And you are? Uh, oh, I apologize. I am Akishi. Here it happens to be the Camarocho Guard. Camarocho Guard? Oh, that volunteer group doing a community watch type of thing? You know us. Well, it's nice to meet you. Tanamura-san. Hmm. How did you know my name? Working in the area has made me really knowledgeable about the local police. And boy, have I heard a lot about you. I'm almost certain it's nothing good. Anyways, nice to work back. Nice work back there. You resolved the situation by being the first on the scene and handled things expected, expeditedly. I just came by because I was on the area. I was in the area and heard about it on my radio. Our group gives its all to maintain the peace here in Camarocho. But with a pleasure district this big, even our combined efforts can't cover all the problems that arise. That's for sure. Plus, and I'm not the only one. I'm not sure why. There's been some mystery group trying to interfere with us lately. The nature of our work requires we put ourselves in harm's way. But now we have people actively working against us. Our wolf ranks are thinning. Hmm. That's not good at all. Which is why I have a favor to ask of you. Would you mind lending us a hand? Huh? Keeping the peace is technically my job, but I don't think I can just up and join your group. You won't have to actually join. You just have to help out once in a while. Our goal is to resolve incidents like the one you just dealt with. We want to make Camarocho safer for everyone. To do that, we need the assistance of police like you, that n know much more than we do about the area. We will use our funds to reward you, depending on how many incidents you were able to resolve. This isn't for me to say, but we've heard rumors you were financially in need pretty often. Anyways, we will pay you a fair amount for your services. Do we have a deal? Hmm. One thing bugs me. What is it? Well, you said you guys are volunteers, right? That's right. Then what's with this funds I'm hearing? Huh. Volunteer groups usually just barely scrape by. That is, unless you have some strong organization backing them. Well, if you can't say, that's fine, I guess. Not like I have anything to lose. Thank you, tenderwater son. You can come by and help whenever you have the time. We won't force you to do anything you don't want to. All right. But only when I hear something on the radio and have some spare time. Really? Thank you very much. So I go to you for the reward money, yeah? Yes. I, us I am usually here, at Theater Square. Cl contact me once you've resolved a couple cases. You don't mind me collecting a bit on the side from the people I, can I help, right? I have no issues with that. Roger that. This is going to be a such a big help. Thanks again. Well, as long as they're working for the benefit Camarocho, it won't hurt to help out. I think, I don't remember if, god damn it. Hello? Uh, uh, he, Machan, I've run into a little problem here. Would you mind stopping by the restaurant? Okay, be right there. Thanks, see you in a bit. I wonder what Zao's gotten mixed up in now. The easiest way to Zao's place, homeland, is to cut from the East Tihi Boulevard. That means go to Asia. Like, Little Asia, go there. Here, let's see. 
Is there anyone around who would want to pick a quick fight? I think this guy over here. No? Really? See, I might just be dumb when I'm about to say this, but I don't think you get any random encounters as Tanimura. You get fights because of the police scanner? Or am I just not, you know, far enough in to just be fighting any random guys? I'm not sure. Because I'm not seeing any random encounters anywhere, and there's just too many police for any random encounters to really just pop off. That's kind of annoying as hell. Oh, no, wait, here's one. Let's figure something out really quick. What moves does he already have that he has no heat abilities? Really? No heat actions. Alright, well he basically has nothing right now that could enhance. Except for stuff like this. I really do like his taunt. His taunt, it's cool. Oh shit. Oh. I think there's even an upgrade for his taunt that um, instills fear in the enemies. I mean, wouldn't wouldn't you get scared if a guy just started pulling out a gun and shooting it mid-fight? Like, is he gonna shoot me next? The sacred tree armor, sacred tree arm guards. Pretty sure that, oh yeah, that's for winning at the training stuff. Well, we'll be giving all that to Kiryu because obviously he'll be up after Tanimura. And I actually will need that with his because of his final um, long battle. Oh. Suspicious street vendor. Tenkichi Alley. Oh, I'm here. It's a suspicious street vendor. Okay, Tenkichi Alley. You Serena Alley. Oh, this is him. <laughs> What are you up to here? Crap, a cop! I ain't up to nothing! Little bitch. Damn it. What? I've got your number now, boy. Shit. Yeah, you tired. What the? Don't even start that. Are you kidding me? No. Oh, no, you do not. You think I'm an idiot, friend? At this point, I know how to pull off all the moves. Come here. You're under arrest. For bullshit. 
okay, Tanamura, calm down. Mm-hmm. Then what were you selling? Um, hemorrhoid cream, hair growth restore, toothpaste. What? Look, I'm just selling stuff that the top yakas out there are too embarrassed to buy on their own. Come on, just take this and leave me alone. Hmm, interesting. Hmm. 